When will this project, when will... When are we starting? It's starting today. Because if we lose her, we've lost it again. This is the beginning of this vision. This is the beginning of a project. This is the first day, and I think back to other times when I've done this. And you remember the beginning, you remember the end. Sometimes the middle stuff is a bit blurry because it gets a bit crazy. But this is, this is the start of something exciting and I'm really, I'm pumped. I'm sort of excited to see how it all comes together. You know, it's interesting living in New York City. I mean, it's such a concrete jungle. You know, you're racing around, you're, you're surrounded by cement. And the last thing you're often thinking about is, is actually nature. I grew up in Australia in the outback. I grew up in, on a farm. So for me, this is such an incredible contrast from where I came from. I love to go outside New York, you know, upstate or wherever and sort of experience nature. And you, there's got to be some sort of balance. As human beings, we all yearn for that connection to nature. One of the things I feel really lucky about is the fact that I can work on creative projects that make a difference in the community. I just wanted to do something that would almost, you know, bring a bit of sexy back to the environment with nature as inspiration to create a photographic project that really allowed me to live out my fantasy of getting to shoot the top models in the world and some incredible celebrities that would really go out there and to speak to a younger audience and get them involved in the conversation around the environment. When he sets his sight on something, do not stand in his way. When he goes, he goes the full mile. You know, I worked on many projects, whether it's for breast cancer, adolescent sexual health. I worked on a, a project called Move for AIDS, where I actually went out and shot a book of dancers of New York. You know, I love to work with dancers. I was a sculptor before I was a photographer, so for me that was like a really great creative project. My Move book took me six years. I would like to say I'm most grateful as an artist for being able to do this and benefit and support AIDS. And of course, James, for donating these incredible photographs. James, you're a hero. Thank you so much for your time and your effort. Bravo, bravo. When you go out to create a project like this, it's so important to get the right partners on board. And the premier studio for me is Milk Studios. Someone like Rossi, he is a visionary. With Milk, Rossi's been able to really create this incredible media hub that is like almost at the, the forefront of youth culture and the industry. I launched my MOVE project here at the Milk Galleries back in 2006. So when I came up with this idea for this project, the first person I went to was Rossi. Hi, I'm here for a meeting with um, Rossi and David. Oh my God. <laughs> How long has it been? <laughs> Too long. <laughs> in terms of what I've been up to, obviously the, 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 the sex film took me four years, the Let's yeah. Talk About Sex documentary, which was amazing. It was launched yeah. on TLC, it's now on Hulu. You know, I have a big vision anyway. The, the, yeah. the, the Move book raised almost half a million dollars for HIV AIDS. It was a massive success. Yeah. For this next product that I want to focus on is the environment. How can we, you know, really try and connect this with a younger demographic? And, and I think it's about bringing a bit of sexy back bringing a bit of sexiness and back into, into the whole issue, yeah. you know? And I, and I think it's about celebrating the beauty of the environment. I'd like to be here to, to incorporate um, the leading models, leading celebrities that support the environment, um, and shooting them as for a photographic project called Natural Beauty that really brings the whole environment and, and, and portraits together um, to create an, not only an amazing show, uh, but also sort of a film installation as well. And I know with, with Milk support and your contacts, it can be, we can really blow this out of the water. What's the ultimate thing we're trying to do here? Okay. Uh, the foundation we're working with is Global Green. Oh, it is, oh, it is yeah, with yeah, Global yeah. Green. Global Green. Oh, that's done. Yeah. Tell them that you, know, you spoke with Rossi, that we're on board and Milk, and 
evolve and whatever yeah. else we got to do. When will this project, when will... When are we starting? It's starting today. This starts right here now with this conversation. Really? Yeah, this is it. Okay, we're in. <laughs> That's it, it was done. The one thing I've learned in the past is get as many partners and supporters as you can because it makes your job a hell of a lot easier. And then you can stick to what you really love to do and focus on and let other people do what they're good at. You tweeting? I'm tweeting, look at this picture of my hair. It's major. <laughs> Come on, it's a moment. And put it right on top of it. Yeah. And keep it graphic, I think yeah, it's really yeah. strong. No, 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 the idea is to go graphic. I just needed to keep the volume. Yeah, I think the volume's great. The brow's nice too. Can we give her a little... <laughs> <laughs> You're so twisted. I like how you noticed. You're so twisted. Um, Some people just don't notice. What? How good I do eyebrows. <laughs> um. You know, I've been interested in sustainability and um, these issues for a really long time. So of course when James told me about the project, I was more than happy to get involved. And you know, I hope that it makes people see both, you know, human bodies and women and, you know, objects like coral or a flower or, you know, whatever is being introduced in the picture in a different way um, as something that, a system that we're all part of. Eyes low, took your head away from me. Gorgeous. Tilt away again for me. Gorgeous. Do that again. Eat like in your back. Beautiful. That hold that. Joe, yeah, that was amazing. Mm -hmm. She's just so elegant, you know. Try white first, then we'll try silver. Actually, yeah, just try one of each. Let's see how it looks. Beautiful images that are powerful make a difference and get people talking at the very least. So that's, you know, something that James should be very proud of and I'm sure he'll have a few heads turning. But what do you think, Hannah? She's much better behaved than she used to be. Well, she's heavily medicated, Electra. Oh, she? <laughs> I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> Bring your head straight for me, Electra. Beautiful. Come around from there. Hold on. No, it's gorgeous. That was so much fun.